In this video, I'm going to do a quick rundown of what I did to upgrade my Prusa i3 um, NK2 3D printer to the newer MK2S version, uh, basically utilizing some 3D printed parts um, in addition to some upgraded rods and bearings from Masumi. Uh, the majority of these parts are kind of like the stock configuration, but a few things have been upgraded such as uh, utilizing a cable chain for the extruder assembly, and I've also printed out an upgraded uh, assembly for the uh, Y axes that's basically supposed to make um, assembling the printer easier and keeping things perpendicular, which for me, I had a lot of issues initially with my first Prusa getting things to square up properly. So this is supposed to make it uh, a little bit better in that regard. And uh, better fan housing. So basically using a Noctua 40 millimeter fan, which is supposed to uh, cool better and provide for quieter operation. So here's a up close view of all the parts that are going into this upgrade. Again, all the bearings, rods, and 3D printed parts. Uh, looking forward to seeing how this goes together. And here is a time lapse video of the entire process. So with that, the printer is completed, and luckily everything went great with the uh, perpendicular calibration. So now time for its first print test. And for this, I chose the uh, included uh, tree frog G code in PLA to kind of see how things uh, went. And the print took about 40 minutes and turned out pretty good. I'll see you here in a second. And here we have the first true print um, as far as functional components, uh, basically some drone parts uh, to upgrade my quad racing drone. So print went excellent, very, very happy with the upgrade. And to finish out, here's a cool side-by-side -side of the before and after. Uh, like always, if you have any questions, hit me up in the comments. And thanks for taking a look.